morning. I'm Kathy Hamilton, and I also serve on the church council. When I began to think about this devotional, all kinds of ideas came to my mind. Favorite Bible verses, inspirational devotionals I'd read, but I got to thinking about what could I do to help during the pandemic. And being under the stay at home order, nothing. Then I remembered what the Bible said. When my people humble themselves and pray, prayer, that's what I can do. And I do so daily because God loves us and cares for us. God's timing differs from ours as we are being brought along the path God has laid before us. Our path forward may not be easy or clearly visible, but we can trust our loving God to keep his promises. Somewhere I read and wrote down Nahum's prayer. This is based on Nahum chapter one, verse seven, which reads, the Lord is good, a refuge in times of trouble. He cares for those who trust him. As I pray this prayer daily, I insert concerns. I pray for the world, our nation, state, city, and church. I pray for those grieving the loss of a loved one or a friend due to COVID-19 or other causes. I pray for all of those who are having trials and hardships of health, those without jobs, those working during the pandemic and cannot be with their families, and all those on the front line doing their part. This is what I can do, and I know many of you are also praying, so keep it up. With God's help, we will get through this together and see each other really soon. Let us pray. Jesus, please show your goodness to us during this time. Be our strong refuge. Reveal your closeness to us in a tangible way as we trust you. And may the grace of our Lord Jesus Christ, the love of God and the fellowship of the Holy Spirit be with us all forevermore. In Jesus' name I pray, amen. Have a blessed day.